Yo, what's up everyone? We're back with this Ninja Gaiden on hard difficulty. Back with our chapter 3, Skies of Vengeance. And where were we? What were we doing? I took a little break, so... I'm alright. I'm already. Oh my gosh. I should have done some warm-ups. Oh god, I really should have done some warm-ups. Shuriken, oh, I'm in charge of But, uh, yeah, okay. Maybe I should have done some warm ups. <laughs> this game is never easy. Never, never, never. It's always. <laughs> I think things are guys. Um, yeah, but it's never easy. <laughs> This one is the good one, right? The shop guy? Yeah! Alright. Well, now, this is where it starts, things start coming into play. Gotta start leveling this up, because that's important. Um. Also, the golden scarabs start coming into play, so I gotta get those. They give me, uh. certain unlockables, I guess. Not unlockables, I guess, because you can only get them if you don't like the scarabs, but they, um, they give you stuff. An armlet, a technique, a scroll, a level, a life item. They give you a whole bunch of cool stuff. It's, it's nice. They're good to grab, but they're kind of hard to find. So I don't always, I'm probably not going to get them all of them. There's 50 of them in the game. So I'm going to do my best, but just from off the top of my head, because I don't want to just pause and look for them. That's ridiculous. I grab the ones where I know for a fact they're there, or I'll maybe take a gander. But yeah, if you get all 50 of them in hard and above, I think you can get the uh, the dark dragon blade, which is honestly ridiculously overpowered. But you get like right before the final fight, so it, it kind of makes up for it. I don't know if you have it during the final fight because the final fight the guy used the dark dragon blade. So I mean. I mean, if you guys didn't know that, I mean, come on. It's things being hyped up the whole time. That's not even a spoiler alert. It's like just being a good prognosticator. But, um, yeah. Yeah. You gotta find it. I don't know how that works. She's gonna use that first. The sword does not do well against the knife. She's not. I got new moves! Oh, I didn't get the. It's gonna drop me, so. I'm right there. Breaking that guard left and right, boy. I'm still sick, humble, though. Alright, that was easy. That's why I just said this game's never easy. <laughs> but it's really not. I just. Good! At video games! Um. I'm just gonna do this because you can unlock it and that's just faster and easier. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Now, speaking of scarabs, there's one right here. This one gets you introduced to the scarabs. You see it right there. It's super easy. Whoa. There's that. But this is your main point of interest the scarab. Golden scarab. A report from a junior officer lies at the captain's desk. This is regarding the incident on February 22nd, in which all of the locks were deactivated. The source of the problem was found to malfunction to the primary power supply unit highlighted in green, so you know exactly what to do, in the aft cabin. Voltage irreg 
irregularities caused by aging of the unit cause the fail safes to kick in, activating emergency power. In this type of situation, all locks aboard the ship are deactivated as a safety measure. I recommend that we upgrade our electrical power system as soon as possible. Which thankfully they didn't. Not yet. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go cut the power! Whoop whoop! I mean, what else would you do in this situation? You're a ninja trying to get off this thing because everyone's trying to kill you. So, cut the power so all the doors open. Oh, this isn't the one. There's like one part where you're like wailing on the electrical stuff and that's how you break it. It's hilarious. Because that would never work. They'll fuck up Ryo Hambu so just get shocked and die. But, you know, whatever. Video game logic. Never fails. It just works. I think I'm here right now. Oh, uh, yep. Hey, guys. Excuse me, guys. Do you know where the aft cabin is and the power source is? No? I didn't Oh, boo. Horse crap. Dodge. You didn't have time to grab me. Get me this thing, buddy. Hey, hey. Show your horse. See? You guys need to calm down. That's it? Two hits? Are you for realsies? Oh, okay. That's it. I thought it was more. Oh, 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 hey, hey. There is more. Sorry to see. Oh, fucking. Just wait till I get a grab. You're all gonna be dead, bitches. Someone dropped my ID card. It's just so. Uh. Uh. Damn it, what's the word? I'm blanking right now. Dude, I really can't think of the word. Oh shit! Oh shit! We got ourselves a new double sword bullshit. Let's get going. These are sick as hell. They're not as good as the dragon sword because the dragon sword is the ultimate game, the ultimate weapon in the game basically. But these are still pretty sick to watch combos with. Let's see if I can do anything with level one. Well, I don't know. If, I think they kind of suck at level one, but let's find out. Yeah, they're kind of stuck at level one. I don't know what to do. Hey, hey, that's kind of cool. Alright, we got the ID card. We're making good progress. We're getting through this thing. No problemo. Dude, I still can't think of the word. It's kind of pissing me off now. It's when something is just so easy and just so perfect and it's like, that should have been that easy. Yeah, I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about, but I'm just like, uh, make a derp. Ah! I don't need a cam book, like, yeah. Oh yeah! Get your brand out. Oh, I didn't mind. I was dizzy. Oh, lame. What the hell is she doing with a rocket launcher? Yeah, okay. Okay. I need to be smart. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Well, I deserve that one. I'm not even lying. That wasn't bullshit. That was me. I goofed. I didn't pay attention to my surroundings, and I hit that barrel. I was gonna go see as long. As I was gonna see how far I could go without dying. But you know, games. I guess what? You're gonna die right now. If you guys want to see more of the Dragon's Claw and Tiger Fang, comment and I'll record more with that, but I need to go the easy route right now. Let's use this, because this is the best weapon. We use most efficient and the strongest. Oh, wait. oh I decapitated him! Damn it! Okay, that hurt me life. What the hell? Where's that one coming from? Thankfully, projectile guys- What the shit?! Projectile guys are usually super easy to beat. Oh my god. That guy was non-stop. Jeez, and too many jammers! The difficulty spike was just... 
ridiculous. Convenient, is that the word? That's the word I'm thinking of. Where something just so easy, like, oh, I'm gonna just... It's so conveniently placed. Yeah, I guess that's the word. Okay. Go up here. Grab this, and then they appear. Ah! Wrong damn. Did I get them both? Really? Alright. Cool beans. Come on, get the health. Get the health! Get that! Come on! Damn it! He's trying to get the health. Whatever. I guess I should heal probably. I have so many healing items, I didn't even realize that I, I, I should be using one last one. Son of a biscuit. I'm an idiot. Well, I found the ass cabin. Camera change. That means there's enemies. Ready? I told you. Whoa. Buddy. Buddy. Ah, oh. What the shit? I was in the middle of bleeding. You cannot. That's it. Mm. Drop your ass off the plane. What's over here? Oh, a healing item. Generous. What was it? Oh, damn it. Somehow making it for the ninjas. Oh well. Um. Right, here it is. What does that interact? Here we go. Now comes the fun part. Ready? Yeah! Uh. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna wreck shop in here. Don't mind me. Blowing everything up. So now all the power's cut. So now I can go do whatever I want, wherever I want. An announcement can be overheard the, can be heard over the intercom system. There has been a malfunction in the electrical system. Switching to emergency power. The locks and all doors have been opened as a safety precaution. So now everything's unlocked. And I think I gotta fight more guys over here. Oh, yep. Okay, he has a rocket. That was rude. None of that. None of that. Way on him. I don't remember the other guys that come this way. No. Okay. Because if you get hit from this, guess what? <laughs> Say goodbye to Ryu. His ass falls and dies. I've been out here way too many times as a kid. It's ridiculous. Thankfully, I learned from my mistakes. Not very well, but I learned from them sometimes. Alright. Go, 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 go. Alright. Pause. And. Bang. Save completed. Ah. What to do, what to do, what to do. I think I gotta go this way. Alright. Uh, main deck, yes. So, as the game would have you do, you go towards the, uh, you know, towards the main. Not the main. Not this way. You go the other way. From where you first saw the door was locked, and then there's you go go through the main bridge and stuff, and all kinds of stuff like that. But if you come this way in this room, there's a secret. It's not a secret. Like you, you basically go through a gauntlet, and uh, once you get to, once you get through the gauntlet, there's some cool stuff to you. Let's go, motherfucker! Oh! oh. Ninja moves. How about no? Excuse me, boy. I think it's sneak up on a ninja? I don't think so. Easy. Easy peasy. That one's crazy. I'm saving it for you! I'm close, I'll take it for you. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Done some ninja moves right now. Feeling it! Slicing, dicing, heads off left and right. 
Let's go, let's go. Ah, I see you. Fool. Can't do this. I'm a ninja. I block your bolt to my sword. Makes sense? No. But guess what? I'm a ninja. It doesn't need to make sense. I got ninpo magic powers and school crap and whatnot. How about ya? How about you? How many more heads do I have to cut? Ooh, you survived. Nice. Come on. You give me a challenge. Give me something, gang. Make me say this game's hard as fuck. Prove me wrong. Don't let me say it's easy. Don't let me say it's I'm doing this easily. I kinda am, but don't let me say that. Okay, okay. There you go. Give me something. That's it. Let's go, game. Let's go, game. That's it. That's what I wanted. There you go. Give me the enemies. Keep I have no health. So have them take it. Let's go. I don't want an easy game. I want to play this guy. I want to play some easy and go to Dark Souls. <gasps> oh! I'm just kidding. That game's hard to fuck. I'm just like stuck in that game. This was like Dark Souls before Dark Souls. And I feel like the, the creators of Dark Souls were like playing this game. And then they're like, yo, what if you had to do all this shit in this game? But as like a regular person. And that's what, you know, I guess not regular, but not a super cool badass agility ninja. So that's what kind of created Dark Souls, in my opinion. I'm sure it's nowhere near the truth, but it'd be just a hilarious video. Well, you should stay home today. Oh. Yeah, game sound is relentless. There's another part with Fiend where you can find like 30 of them. And they're pretty tough. So, oh, they're bringing up the rocket launchers. I feel like the higher the difficulty goes up, the more enemies you can fight in these gauntlets. But if you fight them all, you get some good shit. Holy shit, I have fucking five minutes left for the enemy to look like. So, what you may have seen me do right now, which is bring this out, it's karma. I've killed 59 enemies right now. Going on 60. 60. And that time is if you beat, if you kill all the enemies within that certain time frame, you get an extra score bonus. Oh fuck! Good thing I need those health items. Um, what do you call it? So yeah, it has it's, you know six and a half minutes left almost. So. It's, it's gonna be a while, guys. And then it's... Okay, so let's, let's talk about something. What do you guys want to talk about? What? Uh, fuck. You guys watch Rogue One? That shit was alright. That was pretty cool. I mean, it was different, but in its own good way. Like, if you watch Star Wars, you used to watch a Jedi duke it out, who has force powers and stuff. But this one just was like all about the rebels and actually having them fight, which I guess, you know... It's not like it was, that wasn't advertised what he was talking about, but I thought it was different. And I'm like, hey, I can get down to this. And I'm watching it, and, the, and Big Daddy Vader came out, and I was just like, all right, all right, yes, yes, give me the Vader. I wonder how powerful he is. We never get to really see his true power. We see some cool stuff he does in the, in the Star Wars movies, yeah, but those are old, so it's like, it's not a cool special effect you can do, really. But if you guys have read the comics, Vader the powerhouse. Like, he quite literally just demolishes rebels left and right. He kills all the Jedi, no problem. He's just one of the most powerful by far in Star Wars. Like, ridiculous. There's just one comic panel. Fuck you! I'm sorry. I love seeing where he's, uh, he had just finished, like, fighting, like, 30 Jedi. Oh, I did. Okay, that's it. Didn't take that long. Well, as long as I thought it was going to take. Boom! Mega points! And see, that's what makes it worth it. Um, he's fighting like a whole bunch of Jedi's and they're all just like, oh, and then he kills them all or something, or one of them launches him down, uh, like down a planet and he falls like, what was it, like 100 feet or something? Which isn't that bad for a Jedi, but still, it's not comfortable. So, 
he just like gets up, he's kind of wounded, and he's like, ugh. And then he's surrounded by like 30 rebels, you know, and they're all armed to the teeth with blasters and stuff, and they're like, just stop, we have you surrounded. And then he just, the line he says, he just looks at them and he's like, oh, the one that said that, he looks at him and he's like, surrounded. All I'm surrounded by are dead men. And then the next panel just shows him like walking off and all the guys are dead. It's so sick. Like Vader is so freaking strong. It's ridiculous. Like envy. I was looking for a save point. Let's envious. Just he's too strong. Much too strong. OP. So OP. But that's Vader. That's why he's everyone's favorite. It's a badass mother hump him. So that's it for this episode. That took way longer than I thought it was gonna take, and yeah, that kind of sucked. But I got the scarab and I got the um, the live of a thousand gods. So I'll show you what those scarabs do at the shop right now. We're gonna come back to the next episode. All right.